Hello guys, welcome to Milky Singh Academy. This is your host Jaskira Singh. In today's video guys, I'm going to share about how to use unique and counted function in Google Sheet mobile app. So if you are using sheets in mobile and want to know the unique occurrences of all the entries in a row or a column, then you can apply unique and counted function which will really help you to get your desired results. So by applying these functions, not only give you your desired results, but uh, also will help you to save a lot of your time and effort. And uh, guys, if you want to learn how to use Google Sheet in your mobile, and uh, you are new to Google Sheet, then do check out this my video. I have explained everything in detail, how to use Google Sheet in mobile. And I have also explained everything and every topic in very much detail. So I recommend you to watch this video. So let's start with this video guys. And if you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. I regularly post these kind of videos related to computer and computer science on my channel. So let's start with this video guys. So guys coming to our next function, it is a combination of two functions unique and count of. So here you can see I have already uh, told you that I'm using some certain data sets to elaborate these functions. So this is a data set of a election. So maybe in a company election has taken place and all the employees has been casted their vote to all the like president for the financial officer for the post of legal officer and post of marketing officer and these are the results so these are the different votes for, by different employees so these are the candidates you can see just Keira Jashandeep so these are the different candidates in different positions so what if I want to like know how many candidates unique candidates for the post of president so I'm going to come here so here you can see I have written, written the unique so I'm going to click here and I'm going to write is equal to and I'm going to write unique so here I have to provide the cell range so the cell range is my from here to here because I want to find out the unique persons who are standing for the post of president so I'm going to like go from A2 to A23 so this is the range here so this is the A2 cell and this is the A23 the last cell so I'm going to click on OK so here you can see it has given me this unique function has given me the unique entries like unique names for the post of president so these are the total number of employees you can see now I want to count the number of instances like number of names coming like here you can see just key that comes here and maybe just key that come here so two here so what if I, I have a very long list and I want to count the post for president so I'm going to come here and after applying the unique function I'm going to apply the count if so here I'm going to apply count if so equal to count if so count if it is if you have to provide the range so the range is our similar range so a2 to 23 so now you have to put a comma and now you have to select the creation so i'm going to select this just get it here so this is my creation here e2 cell so it is going to count the number of instances that this just get it name comes in the post of president so here you can see now i can scroll down and it is going to give me all the instances so i'm going to click on autofill so here you can see so i have provided i have done the autofill now i have the result for this election like for the post of president these are the votes so you can see of malki singh john sara and jashandeep has got four votes so that means four times this these names are coming up here in the post of president so this is a very helpful when you want to calculate the number of names in a particular row or you want to calculate the unique names so this function this unique and count if are very helpful in that case so guys that is all from my side if you want to learn more about functions in google sheet mobile i have made a complete tutorial on best 20 functions in google sheet so here you will find the link so do check out this video and uh, thanks for watching and see you soon in next video